So go ahead and write this on your um, paper. If pegmatite is a um, 1 to 1 uranium to lead ratio, how old is the pegmatite? Remember that a 1 to 1 ratio means that the pegmatite is 0.7 billion years old. Okay. If I tell you that the granite is a 1 to 3 ratio of uranium to lead, then we're defining the granite as a 1.4 billion year old rock. Let's say I just give you the ages of two other rocks, that the volcanic ash is 70 million years old, which is only 0 0.07 billion years old, but with volcanic ash is 70 million, and the basalt is 350 million years. Remember, uh, there's a thousand million in a billion, so that's really only 0.35 billion. So let's go ahead and use these ages, the 70, the 350, the 0.7, and the 1.4, and let's answer the questions at the very bottom of the worksheet. So this is asking, can you determine the possible age of the rock unit that has, forget about that, that has bacteria? What is it? And so the rock unit that has bacteria, if you look on your picture, is the slate. And can you figure out how old the slate is? This one is saying, can you determine the possible age of the rock that has trilobites? And again, the trilobites are in the limestone. And can you say how old the rock is? And then the last one here says, what is the age of the rock that contains the Triceratops fossil? Well, that's the shale and siltstone. So here's the answer to the questions. Can I figure out how old the slate is that contains the bacteria? Not exactly, but I can get a range. I know that the slate is between 1.4 and 0.7 billion years. Slate's a sedimentary rock. You can't age date a sedimentary rock, but you can age date granite, which is a, an igneous rock, and pegmatite, which is an igneous rock. Okay. How old are the trilobite fossils, which are in the limestone? Well, I don't know exactly how old limestone is a sedimentary rock. I don't know exactly how old limestone is, but I know that the limestone formed between 0.7 and 300, 0.7 billion and 350 million years ago. So I get a range, again, for the trilobite fossil. How about for the triceratops, which is in the shale and siltstone? This one, actually, I can get more accurately because the volcanic ash layer is kind of wedged in the middle of the shale and siltstone. So I'm pretty sure that the, vol the Triceratops fossil is pretty much right around the 70 million years ago range. And, I mean, I also know that 65 or so million years ago, uh, vol dinosaurs were wiped out completely. So it's a pretty tight range there for the Triceratops fossil. So that should answer your final questions on this Ages of Rocks activity. Hope it went well. Let me know if you had any questions. Thanks.